theft in Washington state that wiped an entire town off the map. At least eight people are dead and officials are now worried that number will only go higher because so many people are still missing. Akiko Fujita is live in Arlington, Washington, where rescuers are still searching for survivors. Akiko. Well, Sarah, officials now say there are 108 names on the list of people that are missing, but they admit they have not confirmed all those names. Crews have expanded the search today with heavy rain expected in the forecast. They know they have a small window to search for any survivors. Another day of searching, no signs of life. Rescue crews combing through mud 15 feet deep in some areas, neighborhoods flattened. There may be people that are in their cars. There may be people that are in you know, houses. We're trying to track that down the very best we can. Half a mountain slid through this community. That mudslide a full square mile in size, enough to cover 484 football fields. Sean Wright ran towards the screams to find a baby and his mother buried under the remains of their home. He used chainsaws to get them out alive. Where we got her was just debris. There, you couldn't tell anything was houses. It was just all debris. There are 108 reports of people unaccounted for, but crews stress they haven't been confirmed missing. Officials say the situation is Again, very grim. That it was Saturday and there were workers, there was uncertainty, and there was transportation on Highway 530. With no rain expected in the forecast today, crews are scrambling to find any survivors, searching from the air, braving quicksand-like conditions on the ground. Heavy rainfall is expected later in the week. The hope for any life dimming with every hour. I'm saying prayers every hour that they find people at least alive and can get them to help. And this isn't the first time a mudslide has happened here. Snohomish County declared a state of emergency back in 2006 after a hillside in the exact same location collapsed. Officials out here today saying seeing the debris this weekend was like looking at a mirror image. Live in Arlington, Washington, Akiko Fujita, Channel 6 Action.